Hey everybody, Boston here. Let's play more Enter the Gungeon. I just started a run and totally hit the wrong button and exited out to desktop. Uh, I did unlock the face melter uh, from the acquisitions department. I remember we finished a hunt. That's what I was trying to do. Uh, we got Gun Knight Helmet unlocked. I need to kill bullet sharks. Uh, 40 of them. Alright, you know, some of these runs they can show up uh, pretty often. Okay, so, uh, we did get some hegemony credits, so last time I bought face melter, might as well just get portable turret and clear out that round of items. Alright, back into the gungeon. <laughs> I accidentally hit uh, return to desktop instead of return to breach, uh, which was what I was trying to do. Okay, so our... I think our... Hey, I thought I killed you. There we go. Um, I think our main goal here is just to finish a run. Uh, just kill the dragon. Um, I don't believe I've finished it with either one of the uh, secret characters yet, so... Um, let's try and accomplish that. Shock some of these jerks. Oh, hi. There's one right behind me. Speaking of jerks... Okay, health, unfortunately, is not going to do anything for us. Um, oh, I thought that was going to be our boss. Let's see if we can find a way to open up both of these chests. Um, that way we can potentially have... Uh, two better guns. Not like this gun is bad, but... It's really not going to last us through the entire run. A run of which I'm hoping will be shorter than last episode's. Uh, this last episode was the, uh, whoops, the clone run. I really cannot afford to take any damage. So I gotta be a little bit more careful. Alright, a blue chest is okay on the first floor. Excuse me, just had a huge yawn. Need a nap or something today, man. This YouTube life is tough. Alright, we haven't found anything yet. There's our shop. And we definitely have enough money to buy a key, and we just got another key. Let's pick up this guy. Was this Moon Gamma Ray? I don't really think Gamma Ray is going to be worth it. We have three keys, so let's... We'll definitely come up here and open this. It's a little chancy, but... Oh, we get, uh... Disarming Personality. That decreases the uh, prices in shops. Yeah. Okay. Pretty good to get early on. Uh, that should benefit us through the entire rest of the run. Could have benefited us in the shop uh, here, but... Uh, I'm, I'm not going to get too worried about that in general. Ooh. Man, I wish I could have the window open today. It is about 95 degrees here in beautiful San Diego, and uh, it is too hot. <laughs> and unfortunately, the birds are really out in full force today, so can't have the window open. I'm not really interested in going down to uh, Oblet. Uh, I don't think we gain any serious benefit from that uh, with its uh, general level of difficulty, um, especially since we can't... Wow, okay. Uh, especially since we can't get any um, extra health from fla flawlessing that boss. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, sure. This is fine for this boss. I don't think I can... Nope. Can't electrify him because he's floating. Which is fine. We'll poison him instead. Yeah, this is pretty loud in my headphones. Whew. That was a little closer than I would have liked. Does that do more damage or does this? 
think they do about the same. This just has the added side benefit of poisoning. Yeah, not messing around with that. Right, we're about halfway th we're over halfway through. By about, I mean actually over. Yeah, that's another perfect one. No, 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 no. I don't want any of that. Real close. And use up every bullet I have. There we go. It's worth it for a flawless. Right, we got the Rubidine prototype, which is uh, actually pretty good. I think we also just got a uh, 50 coin drop there. Which, I sort of wish I would have gone back to the shop to see what's on offer. We're back up... I was gonna say we're back up to our starting health. But we are not now. Oh no, we are. Hmm. I thought I got hit by that, uh... Shotgun kin. Odd. I mean, I'll take it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh... Let's use our <clears throat> starting gun for a little bit here. These enemies are easy enough that we should be able to whoop, should be able to take care of most of them without an issue. We'll save our ammo for some more pressing matters. Oh, hey. Well, we're in a pretty good shot uh ugh. We're in a pretty good place for our shop. Apparently I'm just gonna have... Uh, I'm just gonna be reversing all of my sentences today. Um, since we already have two co uh, two keys, we got that f what I think is a 50 coin drop. Uh, we can we can definitely at least buy one key on this floor. Uh, get ourselves into a, an even better position. And then we have a... Oh, come on. That was just a bad... That was a bad dodge on my part. Um, and then hopefully we can find... Um, something good in the shop that will... Sort of... Help us long term, I'm guessing. Ah, oh, there's our shop. Good. Um, we have enough money to buy ourselves something nice. So I sort of want to treat ourselves. Okay. Oh, now my computer is going to start getting warm. That's a real bad sign. So, yeah, we're definitely going to pick up Magic Lamp. I haven't had it on video yet. Crazy. Uh, three times the charm, uh, gunnies, unlike their non-gun counterparts, have no problem with death wishes. So that's going to be our boss killer. Uh, hands down. Only thing I would hope for at this point would be hungry bullets. Uh, that makes it really lethal against a ton of bosses. I haven't found any chests yet, but we are well equipped when we do. Alright, let's open that. Oh, we get the uh, wind-up gun, which is fine. Right, that's our crypt. So I think the other chest is actually right up here. Just right next to it. Oh no, huh tricked me. Now I'm gonna have Pop Goes the Weasel stuck in my head for the rest of the day. Ooh, nope. Hey, Bull Sharks. How's it going, guys? That was a terrible time to need to reload. Oh, the, uh... The one way of that two, uh... The opening of that door was on the other side. Ah, that was greedy. I, sh I definitely should have gotten punished for that. I, I don't blame the game. I'm playing pretty poorly today. That's a little... A little frustrating overall. I do have a hard time with the robot. You know, I kind of... I kind of treat it, you know, in Isaac terms like Blue Baby. Um... So, you just, you need to be a lot more careful 
than I am being. Or you just need to get a really good run gun right off the bat, which we kind of did with, uh... Oh, don't be dumb. Um, with Magic Lamp, I just sort of have to make it two bosses. Let's use the Rubidine prototype for a little bit. It's pretty strong overall. I don't know if I got that Lead Maiden with that Shock or not. Woo! Ah. <sighs> this is going really poorly. Let's try going this way. Boy, today might be too hot for me to record a video without the window open. My computer is starting to get to the point where it is, oh my god, really upset. Just about as upset as I'm going to be if we lose this run. a little bit more safely. Ooh, nano machines. That gains armor when damaged several times. Okay, so this puts us a little bit, you know, back in the game a little bit. Uh, we found both of our chests. That's actually the full floor. Does he have anything else for sale like armor? He does. 26. What a steal. Okay, we need to bring out the magic lamp, of course. This is not a super great boss for magic lamp. But as you can see, you hit something three times with it, and a buff genie comes out to punch the hell out of it. So, just for its sheer ridiculousness, I love this weapon. I need to get the hell out of the way. Nope. Oh my god. Nope. Oof. Holy hell. This thing is so strong. Switch it up to kill those shots. Whoop. Almost missed those. Go! Punch him! Woo! So strong. Love this gun. Alright, pick up our credits, pick up two keys, which is really great. Pick up a Dungeon Eagle, which is okay. Um, let's try using this in our item room back here. Beep. Nothing, okay. Dungeon Eagle is alright. Let's take a drink there. Should have started that sentence afterwards. I should just found out you can charge the the Gungeon Eagle, which is kind of crazy. So it seems like it does greatly increase damage. Um, there we go. Uh, and makes it incredibly ammo efficient. Not as strong as something like the Mega Hand or the uh, the Heroin. You know, those are. Those are really great weapons. I'm gonna absolutely put that in the mag in the uh, magic lamp. We're back up to five health, which makes me feel a lot more comfortable with this run. Should have been a lot more had I been playing a little bit better, but I'm not gonna beat myself up too much about that. Just you know, a respectable amount. And nano machines will save us from ourselves a little bit, though I don't want to rely on it. Right, see, Gungeon Eagle fully charged up doesn't even kill a uh, bullet kin in one shot, which is pretty frustrating. Let's get them back through here. Just walk into anything. Ooh, more armor. Great, back up to six, back up to our starting. I like these rooms.
I mean, it'll hit him and it'll take care of him in two shots. It just. It's a little bit frustrating with. How many normal shots does it take? Three? Okay, so. I mean, it's ammo efficient, but the. The charge time is kind of killing me here. Oop, nope. So I think I'm just gonna use it as a regular pistol. Yeah, let's get the hell out of there. There were two of them stacked on top of each other. I did not realize that. There we go. Ooh, the shop. All right. Pick up a key. I don't want either one of those weapons. 30. It's getting a little rich for my blood, shopkeep. I do have fine taste. Thank you. So kind. Starting to get a little framey. Really wish I had my active item charged up. Hey, we do. All right. Let's shock the hell out of him. One more shot? Two more? Come on. There we go. <laughs> Can't aim worth crap today. Okay, we have our boss. We haven't found... Let's open that up. Haven't found either one of our chests, which we definitely want to do before we fight our boss proper. Oop. Okay. Not entirely sure how that guy died, but uh, I will take it, because it means I didn't get hurt. This is kind of a nightmare room. <laughs> Jeez. Of course that's not it. Gotta get Bub or Bob. Health does me no good. Yipes. Oh no, I'm empty. Uh, wind up gun, sure. If I would get to a point where I could hit the enemies. Oh, all right. This was a poor place to go to. Right, just two of them. I'll take it. Ah, uh, no! I don't like so many things about this room. Well, that worked out. Hold on. Give myself a little bit of protection here. I probably should be using the magic lamp on this guy. Ah! Uh, since he's big and has a ton of health. Ha ha ha! Gotcha, sucker. Should be a little more ammo efficient with this and uh, reload when I get to that halfway point. AK-47 is good. We'll roll with that for a little bit. We're still uh, still early enough where it's going to be sort of damage efficient and ammo efficient. Uh, once you get to, you know, level 5, then it's... Sorry, chamber 5. Uh, then it's a little bit less useful. Man. You can just give me bullet sharks. That'd be, that'd be great. I'm getting too many of these dudes. Wait until I have to uh, hunt you down. Start showing up this often then. Nope, this is bad. <laughs> just shooting at nothing when nothing's there. All right, what should I... Gungeon... Let's do Gungeon Eagle just so we have a weapon that isn't empty. Um, I was going to put it in here, but we still have so many shots left that I don't think that's the most efficient way of uh, using an ammo drop. At least I don't think. Nope, back off. Getting plenty of money here and there. All right. Ah. I mean, we're, we're starting to stack stuff that will give us a benefit when we get a hit. Um, but I'm trying to get away from that. All right, this is a good boss for having this if I can actually hit it with all three shots. Mostly because it does so much damage to him. Ooh, that was really close. I should have blanked on that. Yeah, there's 
That was way too much stuff. Oops. Okay, still doing all right. Oh God, I just almost walked into that. That would have been the worst. Oh no, I got hit. Son of a biscuit. Okay. Got hit so late in the game. All right, we get to uh, yeah, fill that up. We get the ballot, which I just learned increases your coolness stat. So not only should items, active items, recharge faster. Um, oh, let me get more comfortable here. Um, but we should get that. Also dictates um, how often things drop when you clear rooms. The higher your coolness stat, the more likely you are to um, get a drop from a room. So basically, the way that I understand the uh, the formula is. Basically, every time you clear a room, your coolness increase. Your I'm sorry, your chance to drop an item from clearing a room increases, um, all the way up until the point where you do get something drop, and then it resets back to zero, and that that number starts climbing again. Um, how I understand it is the coolness stat uh, increases the rate at which uh, that number grows from room to room. So, you know, if you, let's say, for example, I don't know the number, let's say if there's a 5% chance that something will drop every time you clear a room, um, and it increases by, you know, every time you clear a room, it increases by 5%. Let's say the increasing your coolness like this changes that to 10%. So you're, you know, you're gonna gain an item faster just through the, the percentage chance. Woo! Get the hell out of here, jerk. Um, so I don't know what the numbers are. I, I suspect only the devs do. Um, but that's pretty cool nonetheless. Uh, we have a key, which is three, which would be really nice. If we can get another key, this... The AK-47 is not only a really good gun, but... Um, means we don't have to um, have any more keys. I uh, don't need that. So I, oh man. Um, I, I, I think it's safe to assume that we're, really, that we're gonna get a key on this floor somewhere. Hopefully from the shop. Yep. All right, 32. And then that's 57, which increases all of our capacity uh, and allows us to hold another item, I believe. All right, let's pick this up. Great. Uh, we're not going to use it, though. Ah, oh, this is almost out. Well, that stinks. This is doing pretty well for us on this floor. Oop. But as I said last floor, it starts becoming a little bit less ammo efficient, but we're going to pick up ammo for it anyways because it's still doing all right. All right I'm really looking for our, ooh, our chests now. Oop, there we go. Oh man, I hate this part. Okay, what do we need that for? Um, we'll get it for this. If I get another one, I'll put uh, I'll put that in the um, the magic lamp. You know, I was being an optimist and I was saying, hey, maybe that'll be all the enemies in the room. Nope. Purple wizard. Ah. I was fairly sure I was going to roll over that, but at least we found a secret room that contains health and a key, neither of which I really need. But that's okay. Poop, 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 poop. Well, a room full of bullet kin is pretty good for an AK. 
Right, another key. You know, I could go buy Brick of Cash, I guess, from, uh... I don't even know what his name is, the Wise Key. Key with a turban on. Um... Ooh, let's check who this is. Mapman, maybe? Yes. I'd love to map you in exchange for something hopefully really good. This might actually bear on. Oh, no, I would still have some more rooms. Um, icy bullets? Frost bullets. Alright. Uh, let's go back here and let's buy... Oh, they used a key. Ah, uh, the A key. Come on, man. Get together. Alright, if we get another key, <laughs> could go buy a brick of secrets. Or a brick of cash? Brick of cash. What was I thinking about brick of secrets? I don't think that's an item. Oh man, we have to go through there? Will this loop around? Hopefully. Okay, hold on. There we go. RPG is not what I'm looking for. Oh, good, it does loop. Whew. Map complete. Nice job. Hey, thanks. I did something right this run. Okay, let's go back to our map friend. We got Demon Head, which is not that great. Okay, uh, let's break this guy back out, our trusty friend. This is where, uh, this weapon really shines with homing bullets, or angry bullets. Um, ah. Uh, I was able to flawless those guys once by using this, and it just ripped them apart. It was amazing. It felt really great. Oh my god. Please stop being terrible self. I don't want to die in the friggin' kill pillars. Get a little too close there. Yeah, everybody keep their distance. Be cool. There we go. Two down. That's the wrong one. I want that one. Three down. God, that was so close. Punch the hell out of him. Oh, I thought I died. Good punching, buddy. Ooh, that was so close. Pick that up. Oh, Winchester isn't really that great down here. I didn't think that was going to be a shortcut. Okay, um, we're in bad shape here. I will just be honest with you. Uh, fifth floor does not look like it's going to be a fun time. I think the A key is a little bit stronger. Let's try it and be mindful that we'll need two bullets left to, uh, be able to open our two chests on this floor. Yeah, that seems okay. Maybe not the most ammo efficient, but if it's styled after the AK-47, then I don't think it's meant to be. Oh god, we have four of these guys? I don't know if I like that at all. Oh no! Mm. I put myself in a bad spot. I knew that was going to happen. Alright, well, veteran got shotgun kin. I gotta remember that. Alright, well thank you very much everyone for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please toss me a like. It uh, helps out a ton. Subscribe if you want to see more videos in the future and leave some comments below. I love chatting with each and every one of you. And I'll see you all next time.